it's your girl. Look, I don't even want to talk about it. Okay, I've been gone too long. What have y'all been doing? Because <laughs> there's no excuse why I've been gone. Um, I just have I had a lot going on, a lot of changes and stuff like that. So <laughs> we're back. And let me tell you, right now, <laughs> right now, I'm excited because, honey, I'm nervous because my skin is, I mean, I don't really have a hard time with products and skincare products, um, but I can immediately tell when something's just not going to be right for my face you know what i mean my skin will tell me a little burning sensation and all of that yeah it's probably not my face is not gonna like it so i was nervous but excited yes what happened and we're back okay so um like i said what was i saying oh i was scared i was nervous but i said look i'm gonna be honest and you know tell the people how I feel about this I got it and I used it for about a week um, just so that I can really get a feel for the products and you know really see what I like what I don't like and stuff like that so without further ado I know I'm doing a lot of this and I don't know what it, I don't know what this is about but anyway um, let's get into it so we have three products here so we have the total cleanser okay then we have the fat water pore refining toner serum look at how beautiful this looks okay there's no doubt about that like you like it or not the packaging is a one honey this Fenty skin this is a why did I say the name the brand this is the moisturizer and uh, it has SPF in it. So it's some sunscreen because if you don't know any complexion, you need to have sunscreen in your um, moisturizer. There's no questions about it. No matter what, how dark or light you are, you need to have sunscreen in your, for the day, for the day. Don't go to sleep with it though. But anyway, okay, so let's get into it so this cleanser it's really nice by the way they open like that like this I don't know if you could see that clearly but they just open like that and you just you know pour it out it's really creamy it like gets sudy but not like soapy it's still creamy and when you wash it off it really feels like you got everything off it feels almost like how we wish bar soap would feel without the like you know what I mean because bar soap it feels like you're clean because it literally strips everything off but this is like it strips off you know the the dirt and the makeup and all of that but still feeling like there's some natural moisture in your face I don't know if I described that well enough but that's as good as I can do I do want to say all of these products have fragrance I know I was not happy about that but I kind of knew that it was gonna happen before she even said it was gonna happen like before I even saw the video videos or anything like I got into it I saw skincare and I'm like Rihanna's gonna have it smelling good like Rihanna smells amazing I've heard um so they do have fragrance it's not really heavy it's like it smells it's like, it just smells clean. And it just smells, it's like a calming, you know what I mean? A calming smell. But I know not everybody can use fragrance. So that can be, you know, that can make or break people as customers. Just because, I mean, it doesn't do anything beneficial to your skin. Um, and it can also, you know what I mean? do some damage to your skin it's never anything really good besides it smelling good but I don't really care about that when it comes to skincare because I just want the products to work so with that being said um, I was sad about it but when you put it on it's not that bad um, this serum is really good at first I didn't know 
how to apply it, if I should do it with like a uh, a cotton pad or just with my hands. But with my hands putting it on there, it just felt like, you know, it feels light. It doesn't feel like a really heavy serum, but you can kind of tell how it flows. You know what I mean? It's not an, like a heavy serum. So you can do this morning and night. You know, some serums you can't really, if you're gonna wear makeup, it's like, I uh, can't really put the serum on top of make under makeup because it's just too heavy. But this is a really, really good balance. And like, look at this. Again, it's beautiful. Like. And this one comes out like this as well. Um, and of course, like I said, this one has fragrance too. But it's just not bad to me. Like it's not the worst. And then this one is the moisturizer with the sunscreen in it. Um, really cool thing. They have these reusable. I'm sure you guys have seen like uh, this a million times by now. Reusable um a little that's how much it is spf 30 the little refill tube that you can buy separately brilliant okay when i said brilliant i mean brilliant okay so yeah that's really dope just plop that in right there twist the bottom oh, hold on let me put it in oh my gosh wasting my fancy uh that but anyway put it in there and boom when you're traveling so it's not sporty now then you know to, to pull it out really genius of her and her team to do that this one I think smells the strongest um just because it has fragrance and sunscreen so you know what I mean but it does it like again it's not overwhelmingly smelling like flowers and all of that. That's gross. Um, it's not really that bad. I mean, at least for me, I've heard other people say like it's a lot. You can smell it. I'm not going to lie to you. You can smell it, but it doesn't bother me. That's what I'm saying. But yeah, there's no white cast or anything. Like I feel good when I have it on. It just leaves my skin feeling like I have like a glow, but I don't feel oily. I don't feel, you know what I mean? I mean, I, I really, really like these products so far. Like I said, it's only been a week, so I haven't been using it for that, that long. But so far, I really like it. Um, I would suggest... If I can make any suggestions, I mean, look, I, I'm, I'm in no space to make any suggestions, okay? If she don't want to do it, she don't want to do it. But I'm just saying, for the people who don't, who cannot, let me correct that, who cannot use products with fragrance in it, I feel like she should make fragrance-free versions of all the products. I'm just saying, I'm just saying. Okay, because I feel like a lot of people have sensitive skin and they can't use fragrance in their products. It just is what it is. No matter how much you love Rihanna, you might not be able to use Rihanna's skincare. And that sucks. That's like being allergic to sea, uh, shellfish and you love seafood and you being a, and you, you know, catching an allergy at fucking 20. I'm sorry, excuse my language. At freaking 25, I would just, life is over. Like, that sucks. Sorry, Dom. But I really, really love these. I'm really glad that she has SPF with a moisturizer. The only thing for me is that I can't use this at night because um, I just opt for using a regular night cream or a regular moisturizer with no sunscreen to go to bed, obviously. Um, but other than that, I don't have no problem, sis. It's only one thing, and I said that one thing. So, with that being said, it's done. Now, in the morning, I'm going to wake up and I'm going to do my skincare routine. I'm going to let y'all see how it really goes on and everything and how my skin looks afterwards so that you guys can get, um 
a better feel on how it looks and you know the consistency and stuff like that on my face so or maybe I should just hmm, or maybe I could do it now to show you how I remove my my um my makeup right now I have on Fenty um I've been having it for a while now all day so I'm probably all creased up but I was like look at you know what I'm gonna just make this video and I'm gonna show y'all I'm gonna wash my face and I'm gonna show y'all the consistency I'll be back I'll be back obviously like I said I have makeup on um don't mind my face is probably looking really creased up because I've had my makeup on all day and don't mind how I'm sitting because I had to like lean down to be where my camera is. Right, that is it y'all that's all I have for us today I am tired so I'm gonna lay it down but before I go if I really had to if you could only pick one product to use one only one I think my favorite is the moisturizer I mean, oh, it's so hard. I want to say the moisturizer and the cleanser. But the toner is so good too, bitch. The toner is so good too, bitch. Okay. It's going to have to be between the cleanser and the moisturizer. I just love how hydrating this feels. It has sunscreen in it, which like, oh, amazing. You know what I mean? Like when I put it on my skin, I feel like during the day I can just go out with no makeup and I'm protected. The sun is like <laughs> block. It has us in mind. Okay. Black and brown girls. And you know what I mean? Like it really does cater to us. And I, and I love that. Like this is look. <laughs> Rihanna, if you see this girl, I'm a fan, okay? Let me be on the the campaigns, all of that. Like, I will represent you, honey. Just give me one chance. That's it. That's it. But anyway, yeah, if I have to choose these two, I, love, I really do love the toner, but if I really did have to choose, it would have to be either the cleanser or the moisturizer because that is just like key to your skincare. So that's it, guys. That's all I have. I hope you enjoyed this video. Please like and uh, comment down below. Tell me if you've used it, if you want to use it, what's holding you back, what do you like about it, what don't you like about it, and let's talk about it. Um, because, I mean, I've seen other things and people were just like, eh. People were like, I love it. You know what I mean? A lot of mixed reviews. So tell me what you think. I'd love to hear. And um, like I said, like and subscribe to my channel because it's only up from here. Let's go. <laughs> Bye.